going to do my MAC lipstick collection so far. And I say so far because I can kind of guess that I'm probably going to get more. Even though I keep saying to myself that I'm not, I probably will. So I have six. These are my natural lips at the moment. I haven't got any lip products on. So these are my lips naturally. I'll show you them in the tube, swatched on my hand and on my lips. So the first one is Korean Candy and I'm wearing it now. And it's a Sheen Supreme, which means it's really glossy and moisturising, which I really like because I find that some of the lipsticks can dry out my lips, whereas this one doesn't. It's definitely an orange, but I'd say it's more on the red spectrum rather than the orangey, pale orangey yellow type colours. It's more of a ready orange, but I really like it. It's not really the orange I was looking for, but I saw it and thought I'd try it. Um, what I don't like about it is the packaging because it's different to the others. All the other MAC lipsticks I have are in the bullet format and this isn't. Um, and I kind of like things to match, so that's a bit annoying. Another thing is it is a Sheen Supreme, so it is very glossy, but that also means that it goes down really quickly. I've only had this for two days and it's already starting to wear down and I've only really worn it today and I've tried it on like the day I bought it and it's already starting to go down quite a lot. So the next one is this one and it's Ravishing. It's a cream sheen which means it's soft, it's kind of moisturising, it's got a shimmery sort of glossy type finish. This one's definitely kind of a peachy orange close to my lip kind of colour. I do really like this one but I haven't worn it that much so far because it is quite a new one and I'm a massive fan of bright lips and to me this isn't very bright. If you want a duplicate of this I would say Smoked Peach by Revlon is very similar. Yeah, that's ravishing. So this one is Vegas Vault. And it's an amplified finish which means it's really pigmented. It's also quite moisturising. I wouldn't say it's as moisturising as the Sheen Supreme but it's definitely more moisturising than say matte. I think this is my most worn colour. It's like a pinky, orangey, corally pink and I think it would be really nice for summer. It's also a really nice day colour because it's nice and bright. That's Vegas Vault. The next one is So Show. A lot of people call this one So Chored because of how it's spelt. But it is French, so technically it's pronounced so show. I still call it so chord, but because that's how I read it. But it's this kind of orangey red colour. It's a bright red, but it's definitely on the orangey spectrum. I really like this. It's good for daytime because it's still a bright colour. And this is a matte finish. I find that it can dry out my lips a little bit and I have to apply it every now and again or put lip balm on to make it a bit less drying. But other than that, I do really like this colour. And this is quite similar to the next one, which is Lady Danger. This one, I'd say, is a very true red. It's also a matte finish which can be a bit drying, but it's very, very pigmented. It's more red than it is orange, but again, it's not a deep red, it's a very bright, true red. And I really, really like this colour. So that's Lady Danger. So this is the last one, and this one is Russian Red. It's a matte finish, so it can be a bit drying, but it's really pigmented. I'd say this is probably my least worn lipstick um, and it's more of a going out lipstick than it is a daytime one but I do wear it in the daytime anyway. Although I don't wear this one very much, it is still nice to have a dark red. Thanks for watching guys, bye!